hello and welcome to my channel please like share and subscribe if you like this video and thanks so much for watching had to jump on here and show you all this really really quick and you all wonder why there's so many she-he's running around here wanted to show y'all something real quick y'all gay baby it's a gay baby gay baby gay 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 please be gay Be what you want to be, but be gay, okay? Thank you. <laughs> right? No pressure. No pressure, but pressure. Gay baby. It's a gay baby. Gay baby. It's a gay baby. Gay baby. Gay, gay, gay. Please be gay. <laughs> oh. Okay. Be what you want to be, but be gay. Okay? Thank you. Um, I had to show y'all this. You know, this is so um disturbing, y'all, on so many levels. And um, like I said before, they're not letting kids be kids anymore. And this is getting to a point where it's 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 a mental thing, y'all. When you're doing this on live with your newborn baby and you're singing and you're pleading for your child to grow up, you know, fruity pebbles, it's something wrong with you. If it's a girl, you want her to be grow up to be a munch munch. And if it's a boy, you want him to be backdoored, okay? Um, I don't get it, y'all. What is wrong with these people? And this is the part where I have a problem with people that's, um, you know, this, this Pride Month crap. This is where I have a problem with this, y'all, okay? It's not that I have anything against other people. Because whatever they do in the, you know, in their own homes, that's their business. But when you're pushing this stuff off on the kids, and as you can see, she's doing this to her child. There's probably so many others that's doing this as well. And we're wondering why, you know, in this day and age that there are so many people that's turning out like this. It's because of parents like this too. Okay, y'all. I had to jump on here and say something because this makes no sense. And when, when I say that I'm sick of my people that's out here doing the things that they're doing, this is a part of that, y'all. And like I said, I don't want nobody that, you know, um, Fruity Pebble to think that I just can't stand them. But when you're doing stuff like this, I can't stand you. Because let that child be a child. Let that child grow up and decide if he or she wants to be whatever it is. Don't choose for them. And see, this is why a lot of the uh, people don't want them to be hired. You know, would you want her to be a school teacher, y'all? Would you want her to be teaching your children? Because now they're saying that certain teachers that's, you know, in the LGBTQ community are bringing, you know, their flags to the classroom and taking down American flags and putting that up the Pratt flags. And this is a part of that, y'all. This doesn't make no sense whatsoever. Y'all remember this face right here. Because, you know, she should be outed every time somebody see her. They they should, you know, you know, ask her what is her problem. Is she getting the counseling that she needs? Because this is what this is what is needed right now. And I've been saying this for a long time. That the you know, people like this, um, they need some type of therapy. They need to be mentally um, you know, checked. Because this is not normal, y'all. But I had to jump on here and show y'all what I was talking about instead of just, you know, um, just posting up anything, you know, and not, sh you know, saying something without showing y'all. I had to show y'all this because this is so nerve wracking on so many levels, y'all, that it doesn't make any sense. How do you do this to your child? And the people in the comment section is saying, um, you know, they're, they're going off in the comment section. Girl, you go back. You go be, you know, by yourself. <laughs> Y'all, 
It's a lot of stuff going on in this comment section, okay? P the people talking about they losing their marbles. I don't think they had any in the first place. This is why I say there's some type of chemical imbalance. This is why that when they get mad, they can go. Because the majority of, you know, the schools that's getting hit up and stuff like that is transgender people, okay? And I showed y'all that in the video that I was showing y'all. There's some... um chemical imbalance going on in their bodies this is why they don't even understand what they are they don't know if they want to be a male they don't want to know if they want to be a woman and some people will push the issue push the issue to go get their you know um body parts changed and all kind of stuff and then they'll turn around after they did all this surgery and got it chopped off and all of this other stuff and then they'll say oh i think i want to be back a woman this is i mean you know a back a man this is what they do. And this is why I tell you, you have to be careful, in, you know, um, with them. A lot of them is taking all of this estrogen and all this stuff, which is very toxic when you take these type of things, you know, to re reverse what nature, you know, what God wanted you to be. When you are reversing that stuff, this stuff messes up your body. It's just like when women, um, just say a woman goes and um, she have like a surgery for fibroids and whatever it is, y'all. And afterwards, you know, they'll tell some women that they need to take, you know, certain estrogen or certain things. But the doctor uh, recommend you not do it because they say that it causes cancer and all of this stuff. So if you have a male or a woman that's taking these type of, um, you know, street pharmacy stuff to reverse stuff, this affects their body in so many ways. And they're already going through some stuff in the first place because they got little screws missing, if you ask me. That, you know, um, any, I, I'm just going to be completely honest with y'all. Any man that can take, you know, stuff t t to the back, like I see, uh, you know, I'm just saying, y'all, I, 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 I don't know how they can do it and still be walking around. I don't see it, y'all. I just don't see it. And for you to tell your child, you know, you want this, your son or whatever to be like that to be laid up in a, you know, another man's arm when this is not what it was it's supposed to be like, y'all, this is weird, weird, okay, y'all? Um, there's so much going on in their bodies already, and this is why it's so easy for them to take out people. And ask yourself this question before I get off really, really quick. Um, to me, it seems as if a lot of, and I'm not going to say all LGBTQ community is like this because I think I have some on my page that's, um, living with their, you know, significant others, but they make sense. Okay. They make sense as far as that's who they fell in love with. They're not pushing it off on nobody else, but there's others that don't make no sense at all. And this, the big, my biggest problem with them too, is every time is a school hidden. Why are you all the ones that's doing this? You know, trans community is the ones that's going to these schools and hitting these schools up and taking all these kids, which makes you wonder, do they even like kids in the first place, y'all? I'm just saying, do they have a thing against kids? Because, you know, them and a significant other can't, you know, make one on their own. And I'm not saying all because there are a lot of LGBTQ community that have adopted kids and stuff like that. And they love their children. And they are not out here doing what the people are doing. There are some people in the LGBT community that have raised kids that's straight. So everybody is not doing this. But it's a lot of people that that is. And I just had to jump on here and show y'all this, what this woman was doing to this baby and telling this baby that, you know, please, 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 you know, be Fruity Pebble, y'all. It's something wrong. Y'all let me know in the comment section what you all think about this woman, you know, holding this baby and talking about, you know, she wants this child to be Fruity Pebble. Y'all, please let me know what y'all think. Because this is sickening to me. To be honest. And it's not, you know, no point. I'm not trying to be mean. But this is sickening to me. It don't make sense. A child, you shouldn't even be talking about this to this child. And now you see why Target is selling these clothes and stuff like this. Because you got, you know, um, Nupit's Day. People like this that's out here buying it for their babies. And they're making these clothes for these itty bitty babies, y'all. They're targeting your kids, y'all. So just be careful, okay, y'all? That's all I'm going to say. And y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section. Please like, share, and subscribe if you like this video. And thanks for watching, y'all. Peace.